National Combat Aircraft MMU, Khan passed its first ejection seat test. For the tests carried out in the United Kingdom, Thai shipped the front section of the Khan fighter jet to the country. Regarding the issue, TUSA's general manager Professor Doctor in the statement made by Temel Kotal, Khan is undergoing mechanical tests. We continue with the calendar. As our president said, we will make the first flight this year. We buy the ejection seat from England. Tests are carried out in England. We made a preliminary part of Khan and sent it there to be used in tests. The first launch has been made, the second launch will be made. This way, God forbid, if something goes wrong while flying, our pilot will be saved. The program continues as is. Everyone is so excited. The companies that serve us are also working. Our word is our word. May God grant us the ability to keep it. Statements were included. Upon questions regarding the export performance of the company and the sector, Temel Kotal reminded that he is also the chairman of the board of directors of the Defense and Aerospace Industry Exporters Association and said that the increase in the export performance of the sector continues and that the figure will be approximately $6 billion this year. Stating that the same situation is valid for TUSAs, Kotal said, we sign a lot of contracts. The increase in the country's forward orders is much higher than what we can provide in production. There are very good orders coming to Turkey for the next three to four years. When we achieve these, we will see, let's say, $20 billion in three years. If we see $20 billion, Turkey becomes a world player in the defense industry. If you look at the ratio of exports to imports, we export twice as much as imports. Turkey is in a plus position in the defense industry. The date on which the initial conditions called T0 of the National Combat Aircraft Khan were fulfilled is 2018. Within the scope of Phase 1, preliminary design activities of Khan were carried out between 2018 to 2022. Within the scope of Phase 1 Phase 2, detailed design and qualification activities of MMU Khan will be carried out in the 2022 to 2029 period. In this direction, Khan, it left the hangar in 2023. It is aimed to produce three prototypes by 2026. The Block 10 configuration, which will be delivered to the Air Force's command, is aimed to be developed by 2029. 10 TFX Block 1 fighter jets to be produced within the scope of Phase 2 will be delivered to the Turkish Air Force between 2030 to 2033. However, this date announced by the Turkish Air Force was revised by TIE to 2028. Within the scope of Phase 3 between 2034 to 2040, the development and mass production activities of other TFX blocks will be carried out. This date was revised by TIE as 2030.